Hi, in this video we will learn about while loop. A while loop executes a set of statements till a condition is true. The format of a while loop is first we write the while keyword, inside the brackets we write the condition that we want to check, after that inside the brackets we write the code that we want to execute multiple times. The working of a while loop is first we write the condition inside the while loop, after that it will check for the condition. If the condition is true, it will execute the code block. Again, it will go back to the condition. If the condition is false, it will come out of the loop. Otherwise, if the condition is true, it will continue repeating the process. Now, let us see a practical implementation of while loops. For using while loops, first we will need to create a variable. We have given value 5 to this variable x. Then, we write the while keyword followed by an opening bracket followed by the condition. In this file, we have given a condition while x is less than 5, then it will go inside the brackets and execute these statements. First, x is 5, so x is less than 5 is a false, so it will come out of the while loop without executing anything. So there will be no output for this program. Now if we change the value of 5 to 2, then it will check whether x is less than 5, so x is 2, so 2 is less than 5, so this becomes true, so it will go inside this block, then it will print x, so the current value of x is 2, so it will print 2, after that it will add 1 to x, so the current value of x was 2, now it will add 1 to x, so now the value will be 3, again it will go back and check if x is less than 5, so now the value of x is 3. So 3 is less than 5, again it will come inside and print x, then it will add 1 to x. Now the value will be 4. Again it will go back and check whether 4 is less than 5. So it is true, it will print 4 and then it will add 1 to 4. That is the current value of x is 4, so it will add 1 to 4. Now x will be 5. Now it will again go back to while condition and check whether 5 is less than 5. But this time this will be false because 5 is not less than 5, it is equal to 5. So now it will come out of the while loop without executing any further. So the output for this while will be 2, 3 and 4. This is how we can use while statements in our Swift language. Thank you.